Hello student, welcome back to my channel. Today I will solve question answer of this lesson. This lesson name is From Hunters to Farmer, Chapter 3 in History Book, Class 6. First of all, I will solve some question in book. Let's start. Now, A. Choose the correct answer and fill in the blanks. First, the study of the origin and social relationship of human beings is called answer anthropology. Second, human began to grow crops during the age Neolithic. Three, the old stone age is divided into dash passes. Answer three. Four, early human used fire to scare animals. Five, the biggest discovery of the Neolithic age was agriculture. Fill in the blanks. B. First, humans began producing crops through long observation and with human experience. Second, domestication of plants and animals lead to the emergence of village communities based on a settled life. Three, Paleolithic people made crude and unshaped tools. Four, Neolithic people began domesticating animals and producing plants. C. Match the columns. Column A, column B. First, children. Answer C. Meher Gra. Answer D. Baluchistan. C. Cattle Huyung. A. Turkey. 4. Halur. E. Andhra Pradesh. I have done some question in book. After that, D E E G in notebook. From hunters that to farmer. First question. What do you understand by the term Neolithic age? Answer. Neolithic also called New Stone Age. Final stage of agricultural evolution or technological development among prehistoric humans. The Neolithic followed the Paleolithic period or age of cheap stone tools and preceded to Bronze Age or early period of metal tools. How are we able to gather knowledge about the customs and practices of the Neolithic people? Answer, we are able to gather information about Neolithic people by the study of archaeological sites and remains of the period. Three, list two animals that were domesticated during the Neolithic age. Answer, the early humans were hunter-gatherers. Then they began producing their food by cultivation of crops and also domesticated animals. Some of the domesticated animals were as follows. Dogs, pigs, goat, sheep, cattle, horse and donkeys. Four, name the earliest agricultural settlements in the Indian subcontinent? Answer, the earliest agricultural settlements in the Indian subcontinent are the Indus Valley Civilization where the fertile banks of Indus was used as agricultural land. 5. Name the name two village 
settlements found in the Kashmir region that belong to the Neolithic age answer Burjohan Kashmir, Gufkral Kashmir, Chiran Bihar and Utnur Andhra Pradesh. E. Answer the following questions in 50 to 70 words. First, in what way did the beginning of agriculture change the life of early humans? Answer, farming meant that people did not need to travel to find food. Instead, they began to live in settled communities and grew crops or raised animals on nearby land. They built stronger, more permanent homes and surrounded their settlements with walls to protect themselves. Second, why did it became, become essential for people who grew crop to stay in the same place for a long period of time? Answer, people who grow crops have to stay in the same, time, same place for a long time to, to look after plants, protecting them from birds, animals and their other follow values uh, so that they could grow and crops or seeds could repent sharply. Settled life is useful and essential to lead a civilized life. People grow crops to meet their daily food and some other needs. Third, Discuss the importance of domestication in human history. Answer to convert animal plants etc. to domestic uses stem to stem and animals especially by generation of breeding to live in close association with humans being as a pet of work animals and usually creating a dependency so that the animals losses its ability to live in the wild four bring out the difference between the paleolithic and neolithic ages mention at least five distinguishing features of each paleolithic age neolithic age paleolithic age first crude as shapes as um, as shapes stone tools were made second people were mostly scavengers hunters and food gatherers second third people clothed clothed themselves with animal skin and bark of the tree neolithic age first well shaped and polished tools began to be made second people domesticated animals and began producing food third people waved clothes and started using wool and cotton to cover themselves cotton to cover themselves four people lived in caves and roamed around from one place to another five people did not know how to make pottery for people built need people built mud houses and huts and started living in one place for a long period of time time to look after the grains sown five pottery making was a significant features of this age five questions write a bring a brief note on the earliest neolithic site found in india answer by about 5000 bce many agricultural villages had been founded in baluchistan like kiligul muhammad and kalat in quatta valley mundigak near gandhar and sari khola in west bengal pakistan the beginning of agriculture in the Indus plains was a major was a major step toward the emergence of a civilization later as its fertile soil helped produce surplus of food grains which could 
support the areas which did not produce food again produce food grains sorry grains ex, um, excavation at village settlement settlements in Kashmir valley at Burjohan and Gufkaral throw significant light on the Neolithic culture of this region. The area com comprised the hill of Assam including North Khachar and the Nagar Hills. Excavation at Dojali Dojali oh, heading in the North Khachar Kachar hills have also yielded all the objects noted have neolithic culture pass has been tentatively tentatively dated around 2000 bce by the historians if answer the following questions 8200 words first what were the most significant discover discoveries and achievement of the neolithic age why were they important and how do you think they changed the life of the people of that period answer the neolithic age marky the beginning of agriculture people people started producing their own food by cultivating creels such as barley wheat and rice animals such as sheep goat cattle dogs and horses were domesticated both for milk as well as for meat these animals were also suppliers of wool and skin which served as clothes For people, the Neolithic people domesticated animals to use them in their agricultural work. The making of poetry, webbing, spinning and transportation were also made possible due to another major achievement of the Neolithic man, the invention of the whale. 2. In your own words, describe the transition of the Neolithic humans from hunter-gatherers to farmer harder. Answer: Ten thousand years ago marked the beginning of the Neolithic revolution when humans discovered the cultivation of crops and domestication animals. This period marked a period of significant development for humans as they moved from gathering to growing food and breeding of animals it became a significant single development in the history of the man which happened during the stone age period this is why it is called the neolithic revolution during this period okay student i have done all question in this lesson if you like my videos please like share and subscribe okay student love is bye